Uh, hip hop gamer, fresh start. Yeah, you know what time it is. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know what time it is. Brooklyn. Yeah, you know what time it is. Hip hop gamer, no stranger to danger. Wreck your breaker, shot taker, play maker. I show nothing but love. That's how I got greater. But those that don't see it, they stay stuck with the haters. Hip hop gamer, no stranger to greatness. So drop that. Got gameplay, I overwatch that. Biggie small, life at the death, so we be small back. Red dot, headshot, red spots on your hard hat. This is what New York sounds like, and it's all that. Concrete core killer rap game, raw spit a frame data play singer. So you got. Gotta aim quicker, maxed out. Ready for war, we got the painkillers. Feeling like Mike in the game. Ow, thriller. Ow, thriller. This is New York City, we the home of the gritty. Gotta feel me, put the game on. And if you really ride with me, throw it up. Press start, play a part when we pop ball. This is New York City, we the home of the gritty. Gotta feel me, put the game on. And if you really ride with me, throw it up. Press start, play a part when we pop ball. My grandma taught me to be the best that I can be So I took the game industry by the balls And believed in me and equally merged it with verses So anybody wanna battle Get a pen and a battle with two controllers Focus, the flow is explosive Breaking every barrier and parry all the poses Yeah, the game is mine and it's time to be ferocious You can call me rap god when it comes to game and culture Embrace who I am and the world is gonna see it The game industry, everybody wanna be in it It's funny how the leaderboards will show you what is missing And I get it now I got it cause I your top of position listen from the hood growing up we ain't have much playing playstation with friends felt like we had enough it was those days with sega how we was raised up gotta love sonic cause lost rings that came up Whoa. Whoa. this is new york city we the home of the gritty gotta feel me put the game on and if you really ride it with me throw it up press start play a part when we pop ball this is new york city we the home of the gritty gotta feel me put the game on This is New York City. This is New York City. We the home of the gritty. Press start when we pop ball. This is New York City. This is New York City. We the home of the gritty. Press start when we pop ball. Gamer, Hot 97, Logitech G. Yo, first off, we about to fight the good fight with my boy Zayabe, Zayabe in the building. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, first off, I gotta, I, we gotta set it off right, man. I gotta ask you this, because I'm a hardcore gamer. So, first off, no, no. What Xbox, what we rocking with, son? Oh, wow. Well, I'm, I'm rocking with the PS, the PS5. Oh, you want to get the PlayStation 5? All right, cool. That's what I'm talking about. You right here. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt. <laughs> you right no here doubt. with it. So yeah. now, now let's let's get right into the conversation, man, with the um actual uh show, The Good Fight. Um, oh, you got your PlayStation? Oh, yeah. All right, so we really gotta get we really gotta get into this real quick. So, my first question to you, man, is what is it like being on set with the level of talent that you get a chance to work with? Like, how does this help you Yo. grow? In your role, bro. Yo, it's incredible, dude. Because, like, um, I mean, I, you know, working with Delroy Lindo, Christine Baranski, Audrey McDonald. Um, this season, uh, working with, uh, with um, we got Wayne Brady on here. We got uh, Wanda Sykes. We got uh, Ben Vereen. Mm. Like, it's just so many, like, dope. Like, Sarah Steele's inc incredible. Uh, Chris Jumbo. Like, so many. Michael Boatman. Like, I mean, uh, 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 like the whole, like the whole gambit. It's just like incredible, <laughs> right? Uh, and um, you know, I love shoot, Mandy Patinkin. It's just like, it's like, if I don't stop to like really like pay attention and like watch them, I'm doing myself. This genius is, you know what I mean. So that I try to, you know, I try, I try to watch, learn, listen, ask questions, play, you know. And then also know if well if they're here, and I'm here, then I mean there's got to be a reason that to, to trust that you know that what I'm bringing to table bringing to the table is 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 worthy of being amongst these many great 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 folks. 
Yo, that's amazing, man. So now my next question is, and this is, um, you know, coming from the political side and just no the doubt. lawyer and everything like that. Do you get the sense of, when, even though it's a show, but do you get a sense of reality or when you look back at the show, like, yo, this, even though there's some comedy to it, there's a lot of truth here. So based, oh, on, yeah. you play, based on you playing your role, um, how does this actual role help you in real life scenarios that you could kind of figure out better ways to handle things that can help people? Yeah, no, like it helps me in terms of like, there's just a bunch of things that I didn't know that the show allows me to explore mm. uh, in terms of with the law, in terms of, uh, you know, how to approach different situations. Um, you know, the, um, you know, also, you know, we, you know this season, you know, uh, Leave me personally, when it comes to like uh, guns and what whatnot, like my, my parents wouldn't even allow me to do that, you know? Wow. So like, I couldn't even do that. If I did that, you know, like, yeah. like they, yeah. So <laughs> let alone like have a water gun, I couldn't even have that. And so the, my character doesn't, doesn't carry a gun. And, and right. this season of everything in terms of with Breonna Taylor, George Floyd, and you know, just like um, the uprising in consciousness in terms of why White folks, because black folks have already been there, but white yeah. folks, um, you know, um, you know, realizing, oh shoot, you know, um, uh, uh, black folks really do have a, 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 a um, have, a, um, right. yeah, but like, um, but but as a black man watching, we did with uh, George Floyd, um, it's like, what do I do? How do I like? What do I, what do I do in situations like that? Is there anything mm -hmm. I can do in terms? Not only that situation. And there's so many different scenarios. It's like, how do I, do I protect myself? When you look at like the internet and you see all of those cats, you know, what is, Jay is like, well, you know, what, what, what do I do to protect oneself? You know, even, you know, he, he, my character is dealing with COVID and all that uh, and having, you know, all, you know, the people that we've lost over the, the course of the year, friend, um, mm -hmm. family members, and taking on the weight of that because my character comes down with COVID, uh, yeah. and, and then it becomes a layer. Is but then dealing with that is like how do I protect myself? And it's just mm. like those are the questions that um, that Jay's dealing with. But then I'm like, yo, for real though, um, as Niambi, how do I like how do I protect myself? What are, what are the things that I that I need uh, to to live my life to the fullest? throughout mm. this chaos yeah so See, now one thing i love about actually the answer that you just gave one thing i love about it is that just talking to you bro i could tell that your passion runs deeper than just the show but there's an actual mm. personal con connection to the craft yeah. and what you're building and that's mm -hmm. why you're on set that's why you're able to be around those geniuses because yeah. just as much as you get from them me talking to you, I can tell they get mm -hmm. so much from you too, bro. And no, that right there is a beautiful thing. Now it's an honor to to, to watch. I, like, I saw it, so this is amazing. Now I'm gonna hit you with this, right? And I ask a lot mm -hmm. of actors this as well. Now, considering that you play games too, do you think the good fight, or have you even had those conversations or talking to the producers, like, yo, this could be something that can also impact the gaming community if this was also a game as well because you got a lot of games like from Telltale and I was going to say yeah you already know what's up I was going to say yeah yeah, yeah. With, with the Walking Dead say. and all those other stuff with the yes. Telltale games yes, 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 yes. and the decisions and the stories yes. it brings yes. us closer to the characters I yes. think I think bro the good yes. fight should be a game as well where the yeah. where we as uh, consumers can get deeper into the characters that way. What's up? Talk yeah. to me, bro. What's up? Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, I agree. I agree. I was going to say, man, because Telltale has all those games with with uh, The Walking Dead, with the Batman games, you know, yep. like like the decision-based game. That's what, see, the Batman game actually is the one that, from, to me, is sort of the, perf the perfect um, sort of like through line to what uh, the good fight could be. Because mm. bat with Batman, you know, when you play the Arkham games, like Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, Arkham Origins, Arkham Knight, yeah. uh, those games, um, you, you, you get to battle as Batman. But in the Telltale uh, Batman game, you get to do the thing that people don't explore, and that's the, the, the detective side yes. of, of Batman. 
so then you're able to like you're you're able to like um you know uh you know make decisions from an investigative standpoint uh in terms of like trying to figure out you know through clues all those things but then also how it affects relationships and so yes. like that's a huge thing that you know you get to you know, see i love games like that where you you um you see how it affects relationships um life is strange is another game like that yes where don't not like, don't not yeah, entertainment made yeah, that yeah. yeah yeah so like that's another one where it's just like you know decision based games how does it affect relationships between you know lawyers uh with clients cuz 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 clients could leave cuz they're like you know you're not you're not paying attention to me you're paying attention to this other client you know lawyers can leave because they're like yo you know i want to go somewhere else where i'm being paid right whatever you have yeah. little games like that on even on the switch um where um there's sort of like the, the you know decision based games where um you know you got to pay uh, one person you know a certain amount of money but then if you do that and they find out and it's like well i want to be paid the same but you only have a certain budget and it's like ah yeah. oh, shoot i can't pay you that then that person could leave and then how much uh, value does do, do you hold in that person so yeah. I do think the good fight the good fight would be an incredible incredible uh, like sort of telltale game. Yo, that would be crazy. So look, I got a couple more questions cuz I know I got to wrap it up. But my next question to you is this, man. When it comes to uh here's the I right, I'm a, I'm going to ask you it's a it's a two-parter. It's a two-parter. Mm -hmm. So I I got you with this, right? So when it comes to being on set and getting into your role a lot of actors talk about how when you get into this role sometimes it's kind of hard to leave out of it and stuff like mm -hmm. that so yeah what's some of the things or some of the advice like some advice that you could give to people on getting prepared for your purpose because you're actually mm -hmm. living your dream so what would you share to other people that's trying to get to where you're at so uh the biggest thing for me um um, I'm very prayerful. That, that's one. Um, so that's uh, for sure. Um, but also the biggest thing for me that that stays with me uh, that someone said in a Bible study group, they said, this is but a season in your life. It's not your life. And as the seasons change, so too will this. So wherever you're at, like if, you know, because I remember I was negative $300 in my bank account. And, um, but then that sort of like sunk in and then all of a sudden, negative three hundred dollars in my bank account, but I'm skipping down the street because I know this is but a season in my life. It's not my life, and as the, as the seasons change, so too will this. And as soon as that happened, boom! Um, I booked a commercial. Um, yeah, booked Shakespeare in the Park, you know, to get to play with uh, you know Al Pacino, which was amazing. Then booked Mike and Molly. Um, right after that, won a grant, you know, um, and then you know, just like all of that happened within the course of a month. When I just finally said, you know what, boom, and it took years to get there in terms of just being like, yeah, you know, not to worry, trust, 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 trust my craft, trust my, um, uh, trust uh, the uh, the journey of just trying to get better, to improve, um, and 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 then live my life with joy, live my life like Gerard, you know what I mean, just like live my life with pure energy, pure joy, pure love, celebrate. Uh, the art celebrate my fellow artists. Um, when somebody get book something, it's not about you, you're not like, dang, how did he book that and not me? It, when mm. they book something, you celebrate it. And you're like, yes, he booked that. That's amazing. That's great. It means it's possible. Yes, that's it. <laughs> it means it's possible. That's yo, all. Yo, I'm gonna tell you something. Um, to wrap this up on my yeah. chain, you see it says God first. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So don't do nothing without putting God first. And everything you just said was so powerful and impactful, bro. So to wrap this up with the final, uh, the final two questions, man. Um, what would you tell someone, you know, in terms of like the good fight, just as a show? Like, mm -hmm. why do they need to see this? Like, why do everybody need to stop, relax, and focus on the good fight? People need to stop and watch the good fight because you have amazing actors all around, as we talked about. Um, we, it's the storylines are, are storylines that are close to, uh, that are close to what we're dealing with on an everyday basis, but actually told in a very, uh, different, satirical, funny, uh, uh, way 
um, in a way that's just, I mean, that makes you just be like, huh, I didn't even think about it. We even talk, we even talk about things that, you know, where you like, um, you wouldn't think that it's a, like a big deal. And like maybe a week later, it comes up and he's just like, yo, that's what the good fight was talking about. So we like, you want to get ahead of the curve. All right. You want to watch the good fight. You want to know what's going down. You want to watch the good fight. Trust. And then to end it off, to end it off, I see you got Joker behind you. I see you got the Joker behind you. So I got to ask you this. You know, if there's any role you could play in the world of whether it's DC Comics or Marvel or whatever it is, whoever you would want to be in that world, who is it? Who would you want to be? If somebody approached you like, yo, we want to bring you in the Marvel Universe or we want to bring you in the DC Universe, whatever it is, who do you want to be? What's your role? What do you want to do in that world? And then we're going to end it like that. Okay, let's see. <laughs> all right, if it's, all right, let's say, all right, so if, it's, if it were the DC Universe, I've gotten yeah. a chance to voice the character, um, but I'd love to actually play the character, and that's John Jones. Okay, what? so, yeah, yeah. So that, that would be wow. Martian Manhunter. I would love to play Martian Manhunter. Um... And in the Marvel universe, like I need to know more because everyone says, yo, you should play him. And that's Brother Voodoo. Wow. So that'd be, yeah, that'd be somebody I would love to play in the Marvel universe. Yo, this interview was fire, son. Yo, God bless you, bro. Love you. I can't wait to see what your next moves is going to be. I'm extremely inspired, man. Inspired, man. I'm telling you. So look, thank you so much for the love. Uh, thank you, you man. Thank this. you. It's the one and only hip hop gamer, Logitech G, on your hot 97 every day. That's my word. Good fight. Let's get it. Peace. No doubt. Peace. Yeah, 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 yeah. You already know what it is, baby. It's the one and only hip hop gamer, hot 97, Logitech G. I hope y'all love that interview, man. Let me know what y'all think of that interview. Make sure y'all check out the good fight, baby. Paramount Plus. Paramount Plus, we out here, you know what I'm saying? So, first off, I want to shout out everybody. You know how we get down. So, shout out to Jedi in the building. My dude, Miss K in the building. I see you with that fire. Love you, girl. What's going on? Frank in the building. Let's get it. Yo, Lawrence, what up? What up? King Mo in the building. We out here, son. So, look, you already know how it is with me. Love y'all. One love and God bless. We about to get up into this Scarlet Nexus. All right, so this is my first time playing this game I, I you know obviously i seen it and stuff like that but i didn't play it yet and i didn't even play the demo so this is li literally my first time playing this so we're about to start a new game we're about to get into it all right so make sure you drop your city in, in the chat so i can shout you out you know and show you love where you from and we're gonna get it in right now once again shout out to my dude my bro uh nayabi nayabi is that dude make sure y'all check out the good fight all right for real like make sure y'all check that out on that note let's get this going on let me know if everything look good and sound good and we're gonna get it popping uh oh it start like that let's get it and you see at the bottom what's up next spider-man 2 we're gonna talk about that let's go toronto in the building j mac i see you all right so we about to select the story experience right now oh word I could choose between. Oh, that's high. All right, cool. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna pick the dude. Let's get it. All right, Yutio Sumaragi. All right, let's go. The graphics is fire, son. And keep in mind, I'm playing in 1080p right now because I'm streaming. But this joint is fire, and we playing on PC. Just to let you know. And once again, let me know if everything look good and sound good. You have to live, no matter what. Let's go. Kansas City, OG, I see you. Cashville, what up? That's crazy. You have to live, no matter what. I can't wait to see uh, what this game is like. Toronto, Bills HQ, I see you. The virtual brain link cable will now be connected. This will hurt much more than it did in training. Be strong. A word? Okay. Systems all green. Beginning SAS cable connection. Oh, wow. 
It looked like it hurt. Is this for real? Yo, video games look too real now. This looked like a Saturday morning cartoon anime. Like, it looks real, man. Wow. Oh, wow. This is what SAS feels like. I SAS. Good. Seems like you're okay. LOL, what's up, baby? Yep, that ghost of Sushishi coming. Your platoon assignment. Do your best. Yes, sir. Yuito Sumaragi. I did graphics is fire. All right, let's see what's up. Okay, move with, yeah, I know that. The change camera settings, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Uh, close current. Yeah, I'm gonna close the tutorial. I just want to get right to the game. All right, this operate camera. Trial. I have to be ready. Stop thinking so much. Open the main menu and navigate. I have to focus on what's in front of me. If I can complete this assignment, I'll be a member of the OSF. Soon able to make my childhood dreams come true yo look at the way wait you see the way this is like set up that's crazy oh, i'm supposed to go over here wait that was that's weird like hold on where am i supposed to go okay let me go over here I was telling me to go back here. This is weird. Hold up. Yeah, I'm a little lost, y'all. I'm a little lost right now. Like I told y'all, this is my first time playing this joint. See what I'm saying? Let me just go over here then. I'll just go straight. Because when I saw those arrows, it was like it was telling me to go back. Oh, there we go. Okay. I should be able to handle any kind of other with my psychokinesis power. Oh, okay. All right, lock on the enemy. Okay, got it. Ah, that's hot. Okay, cool. That's hot. All right, so far I'm liking the controls. It's high. Cause I could just lock on, grab this, and shoot it out. I right, utilize using powers in the sword. Okay. This weapon and text eight, blah blah blah. Okay. All right, let's go. All right. Okay. All right, let's go. Oh, all right, cool. That's the side step. Oh, shoot. I didn't even see him right there. Let's go. You said, why is everybody talking about Sony News as a negative? I don't know how. There's a chance she would know something about her. I have to make it through this exam no matter what. All right, cool. So it says, um, okay, I know about that. Wait a minute. Wait, hold up. You can lock on the enemy. Okay, I know that. Well, I can't kill it, though. Wait a minute. Okay, this is weird. It's like I can't shoot it or nothing. I can't do nothing. Like, am I missing something? Like, what's going on? Okay, lock on. Oh, that's what it is. I had to... Okay. Got it. The enemy. Okay. 
I got it. Hello. Oh, so I got to kill them a certain way according to the tutorial. Got it. Okay. All right. All right, hold up. Yeah, they keep dodging. Hold up. All right, there we go. There we go. I, right, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I got it. The exam should be finishing up soon. The instructor always said the most dangerous thing is being careless at the end. Yo, the telekinesis is fire in this game, son. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just works great. Like, I love the telekinesis in here. Yo, Jedi, yeah, son, this game is dope, man. So far, I like the controls and everything. One thing I would say is the game, it doesn't have like a smooth action feel like a Devil May Cry or a God of War per se. This one feels a little bit more on the stiff side, but it still has a good flow to it in its own right. But it's not as silky smooth as a Devil May Cry or something like that. Hold on, suppress so performance sweeping. Forming a sweeping, moving, spin attack in the wide area. Okay, got it. All right, let's see what's up with this. Hold up. Let's go. All right, perform a attack. Blah. Okay. All right, let's see what let's see what's up with this. Let's go. Let's go. Hold up. All right, let's go. All right, for me, I'm resorting a powerful attack. Okay, got it. Hold up. Hold up. This is okay. While wow, landing. Hold up. Oh, wow. Hold up. All right, we out here. Yo, they got, I'll tell you one thing, this game has a lot of moves. Like all these tutorials, there's a lot you can do and chain together. So that right there is dope. Uh. I do everything I learned from oh, shoot. Training. I should be able to win. I have to. Oh, yo, he shot me through the um joint. Oh, hold up. I ain't being real disrespectful right now. Hold up. Not yet. Let's go. Oh, shoot. Hold up. This is nothing. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go, baby. I, I'm feeling this game. I get, I'm getting it even more. Like, we dope, it's dope right now. Anton, Zach in the building. What's up, baby? One well, love and God bless, man. Welcome to the stream. I appreciate you. Much love. Mission successful. This concludes the aptitude test. Not, oh, my controller ain't drifting. I was just getting used to the gameplay mechanics. Okay, that ends your training. You're an official member of the OSF from tomorrow. Cadets now have 24 hours of free time until then. Make sure to get some rest before your duty tomorrow. Understood. All right. So yeah, so far I'm feeling the game. Um, I think that was a real good tutorial. So now I have a better understanding of um 
just the variety that this game has so far. Because if you could do all of this out the gate from the tutorial, I can imagine the new abilities and things you get later. Wow, yo, look at the city, son. Yo, this, yo, I'm so hyped for this game, bro. Look at this. I, and I love great presentation. Like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like something about to go down. Like, I love that energy. Hey, Yuito, how was the test? Nagi, how did it go? Oh, this is cool the way they do this. This makes me think about Yakuza, how they introduce every character properly so you can feel connected to them. Love it. Pretty good. You were looking rough when the SAS cable connected. Oh, that really hurt. It was fine after I got. Oh, workout boy, these aren't your type of games. That is cool. Sounds like you had fun. That's so like you. So tomorrow will be OSF, just like we dreamed. I can't believe it. Yeah. What's up? You don't sound very excited. No, I'm happy too. Didn't I tell you? I was saved by an OSF soldier when I was a kid. So I wanted to be one as well. But... But what? Lately, I've been wondering if that's it. The end of my goal. I'm here today because... So David, you're going to find out shortly about the Spider-Man so 2 info. I'm wondering if there is a better way to save more people's lives. You can't bear such a big burden like that. People have limits. We're OSF, so we fight others. Let's do our best at the job we've been given for now. Yeah, you're right. I guess I was just being a little anxious. First, I have to become a real member of the OSF. Thanks. Your gratitude is greatly appreciated, Mr. Yuito. So you're going to report to Sumeragi Tomb later? I hate telling the ancestors every little thing. So annoying. <laughs> well, it's not just that. The Sumeragi Tomb is collaborating with Baki right now. What? Sumeragi Tomb is your family grave. I know it's a tourist spot, but they do things like that? I heard it's happening more and more. It's something my father decided on. Oh, right. I have to send a message to my dad and brother. Your father won't reply anyway. I know he didn't want you to join the OSF, but man, that's cold. He's always smiling. Um, I don't know what council. what's the reason for this, like, like Sony bashing. Like, I mean, yeah, the best. But that's probably why. There's some jealousy and envy Anyways, there. I only send him simple messages. Yo, what's up, senior? And um, it's coming. The MGS uh remake is coming. I've been said that. Good work. You pushed through. A direct compliment from Chief Sumeragi. You'll see it soon. I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think July 8th you'll see it. You're making fun of me. My brother's not going to coddle me just because he's the chief of the OSF. Okay, sorry. And also, these types of games, you gotta pay attention to the story and and listen to the dialogue. The fortune you get from Baki. Yo, Weezy is in the building. And yep, I heard about the Dead Space. I'm not sure if it's a, a remake or a part four, but I believe most likely it'll probably be a remake. Alright. Okay. The mini map. Uh, you can turn it on and off. I'm blah. The next objective will be displayed at the top of the location. Yo. That's one thing, man. I love games that let you know where to go next. Like. He really do like Baki, though. He kind of makes me feel nice. Like a stuffed animal I had when I was a kid. Now, one thing is, uh, I know they talked about the different camera um angles. So, I want to see what other camera angles um they have. Well, I think I was supposed to put select for that. Boom, see, next objective. I like that. For a kid, has Baki been around that long? Hasn't he? I can just feel his cuteness in my DNA. Okay. Gotta go over here. Alright. Hey, this is nice. I don't know what this is. Um, these are locations where you can obtain items. 
type item if I make the data item. Okay. This right here. Oh, here's the shop. Here's where you can save. Save the game. Go. Boom. Save the game. Yo, Walter, much love, Walter. God bless, man. And yeah, man, uh, you know, that story really impacted me, man. And I just wanted to share it with everyone else, too. Um, I don't want to talk to this dude yet. I just want to go, go up here. All right, let's get it. Hey, yo, Frank, it's funny that you mentioned Venom. That's all I'm going to say. It's funny that you mentioned Venom. We're going to leave it at that, bro. People paying their respects. Huh, those two girls over there were cute. What? Really? I didn't see them. I can't believe your family grave is a tourist spot. You sure are an elite. My dad and brother are, but I'm not. It's like one of those grand families. Your father is the chairman, and your brother is chief of the OSF. Plus, you're descended from Yakumo Sumeragi, our founding father. Yo, Ari in the building. What's up, Ari? Salute, baby. From the spring of extinction. I wonder what he looked like. Maybe he looked like you. He is your ancestor. He's my ancestor, but that was 2,000 years ago. I certainly don't feel like his descendant. The only oh, which one you should get between Miles Morales and Ratchet and Clank? Oh, Ratchet and Clank. I would say get Ratchet and Clank first, and then get Miles Morales. Ratchet and Clank is the best game ever made. Period. Spring of extinction, right? Oh crap! Your dad would get mad at me for saying that about our country's forefathers. Yeah, shout out to Bluebird team. But you are the Sumeragi House is known for having lots of authority. Your dad got mad when you said you didn't want to be a politician or a bureaucrat. Enough about my family. Let's go get a fortune from Baki. I'm about to go see Baki. You're not going to pray to your ancestors? Okay, let's get going then. Okay, got it. Let's look at the same time. Roger, these are the fortunes that will decide our fate in the OSF. Ready? Ready? Go! Very bad luck. Me too. This is a bad sign. Oh, I'm dying. Let's go to a cafe or something after we tie these off. Yeah, we already got Baki's keychain. Why don't we head to Vision Town? I'm about to go to Vision Town. Let's get it. All right, so we got the Baki keychain. Oh, no, this is why if you reply, some messages will have a time, restric a time restriction on the reply. Interesting. Let's see what's over here. Oh no, that's boom. Oh, so that's a health boost right there. Okay, bet. Y'all know how I get down, man. I'm big on health. All right, let's go to the main street. <laughs> um, yeah, um, uh, I heard that too. So you know, we just gotta wait and see what happens. There's a lot of stuff going on. Um. You no know, cloud wise, so yeah, it's gonna be very interesting. I right, got some jelly right there. The music is kind of cool, man. I like the vibe of this game so far. Uh oh, let's get it. Huh? Others, an other alert. But today's forecast said the threat level here was zero. Yep, Sony got blue point too. Uh oh, let's go, baby. Yo, th this looks crazy. Others, what are they doing in the city? Oh, yo, they rolling up, son. Let's get it. Fire. 
Oh, wow. Let's get it. Crazy enemy design, I'll tell you that. A transfer warning. They're deploying the Scarlet Guardians. <laughs> oh, wow. The Scarlet Guardians. Let's get it. Yo, they look fire, son. This game looks fire. Let's go. Septentrion Karin and Fubuki. Yo, second version command. Yo, that's fire. <laughs> I'm telling you, they got that Yakuza style, son. They itch. Yo, I love it. I love the build up, bro. Karin Regiment, Fubuki Regiment. Yo, Cowboy, don't be leery on Cloud Gaming. I'm telling you. Cloud Gaming now is different. We came a long way from the on live days, you know, in the in like 2008 and stuff. Wow. Hey, Yuito, we have to get to the shelter too. We're not real soldiers yet. Uh, yeah. Well, Walter, I'm playing this game on PC. I, I don't know what this game is like on PS5 or Xbox Series X right now. All right, wait, hold up. Can I go over here? No, I can't. So I gotta go this way. All right, let's go. The other was defeated with one blow. Septentrion First Class. Brain Eater Major General Karin Travers is amazing. Whoa, hyper velocity evasion into an electric blast? Karin Travers is the <clears throat> only one who can use that many powers. He's so cool. Doesn't he have the ability to go? Haptic feedback, powers? yeah. Any game that uses haptic That's feedback, you right? You're gonna want to get that, it's basically like the PS5 version. It's that fire. Uh oh. Oh wow. Whoa, an other like that is nothing against a Septentrion class. Mommy? Oh wow. Hey, are you serious? We're not real soldiers yet. We're the only ones here with the powers necessary to fight the others. We can't. If the instructors find out, we can't just watch people die. I'm going. You call for backup. Yo, I love the presentation in this game, son. With you. Thanks. They show it off in so many different ways. I love this comic book style of doing it. You're the best. What? You think I don't know that? I'll take the right. You take the left. Got it. All right, let's go. Oh, let's go, baby. Oh, shoot. Hold up. Let's go. Let's go. Woo. Yo, you see how I came back to kill him? That was fire, son. That joint went past me and came back, son. Yes, sir. Be careful. There are more others. Can you keep fighting? Uh, sure, why not? I'll take them on. Okay, let's go. Yo, look how they go right into the gameplay, son. So I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. All right, cool. Got it. Let's go. All right. Yeah, the combat is dope, Jet. Facts, like I'm feeling this game right now, son. Yo, Walter. Oh, that new DLC? What? 
That joint is gonna be fire, son. The PS5 upgrade on that joint. Yo, I can't wait, bro. And a whole new island? Y'all here, son. Y'all here. I I'm playing the game all over again. With the PS5 upgrade, I'm playing it all over again, yo. I'm doing the same thing right now with The Last of Us 2. Let's go. Oh, shoot. Oh, look at this game, son. Now die. Wow. Fire. That's odd. You a civilian? Wow. It's her. You have to live, no matter what. Oh, that's shorty from the beginning. We out here, son. This is why I love story. Now we starting to, yo, crazy. Oh, no, I'm a cadet. I see. Either way, our goal is the same. And you see how her name is what in question marks? Because I don't know her name yet. Are you an idiot? Huh? Shh, something's coming. Huh? What's coming? Haptic feedback features is coming to Ghost of Tsushima, bro. Oh, shoot. Let's go, son. We out here, son. Here we go. Huh? Okay. Hold up. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, shoot. Hold up. Real disrespectful right now. Woo! Hold up. Woo! Oh shoot! Hold up. Oh wow, yo. That was disrespectful. Straight kicked me in the face. This is <laughs> oh, let's go. All right, we outside. That should take care of all the other readings around here. Yes. Kasane, I saved that boy. Nagi, you're okay. Yeah, Naomi saved me. Man, I must look like an idiot. I'm just glad you're not hurt. Thanks, sis. Oh. You two are sisters? That's a sister. Yeah, they're both OSF cadets like us. Let me introduce myself. I'm Nagi Carmen. This is Yuito Sumeragi. Yuito. I'm Naomi. Naomi Randall. Alright. OSF. Kasane Randall. Kasane. Yo. Oh, shoot. Let's get it. So it was you making all that trouble. The Scarlet Guardians have eradicated the others. Huh? Oh, wow. You saved Ryujin Ward in that amazing victory over the others. What? Uh, well... What is this? A victory interview? It is. How do you feel? Alrighty. Yo, Big Cloud Gaming in the building. Salute, bro. What's going on, son? Oh, Arashi. So we about to get up in that Spider-Man 2 news uh, real soon. Real shortly. What? Nagi? Huh? Where is everyone? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, what's going on? We should be able to talk here. Uh, what's going on? I'm Luca Travers. Luca Travers. You're Septentrion 6th class Luca Travers? I love Persona. when you put it that way. 
but yes. Yo, Nation World, what's going on, baby? And yes, this game is fire, son. Personal ports so I can confirm your identities. No objections? Thank you. Oh, so wow. So four of you are OSF cadets. Cadets aren't allowed to fight others. I, I'm sorry. Isn't OSF responsible for allowing others to enter the local airspace and putting civilians in danger? Kasane! You shouldn't say something like that. Those are some harsh words. But you're right, Cadet Kasane Randall. I'm sure you all have something to say. But first, report to OSF headquarters. Keep away from the press. Got it? Oh, wow. What's that? Oh, wow. Casualties from the battle. Two OSF troopers on guard duty were killed. I think it's censored, but it's best not to look too close. Huh? Why? Because others eat human brains. Oh, wow. Yes. Looking at headless bodies can have negative lasting effects on your mental health. Wow. Oh, I just imagined it. They should teleport or report them out. It's too far to the morgue and powers aren't omnipotent. We this game time, is crazy. So let's talk a little. I'm sure you know, but one person can only use one type of power. But each kind of power has peculiarities and aptitude. Just as there are types of powers, each person has strengths and weaknesses. To use them in combat, we must rely on devices to lessen the stress on the brain. Wow. That's why things that can be accomplished without powers, or things with low priority, are done manually. Right, sorry. Now then, I'll be going. That'd wow. be nice if we didn't get the others first. I wouldn't let that happen. We're all 567th class, right? We'll stick together and become great fighters. Y yeah. Don't worry. I'll protect you, sis. Let's go. Oh, wow. goodbye, Yuito. Nagi. That girl, Kasane Randall. She looks surprisingly like her. Those two, from the registration numbers, they're in the same class. Are they twins? She's so cute. <laughs> huh? Naomi, she's so my type. Kasane is pretty too, but she's a little scary. Naomi is like her opposite. Shy and kind. Yo, Chariot, what's going on, baby? Yeah, this game is fire, son, so far, man. You're as simple as always. Like, I'm just enjoying it. Like, I love games where I can just play, enjoy, and they don't be fun to play. You should be supportive when your best friend is in love. Yeah, yeah. Tell me all about it later. Let's go. All right, we leveled up. You got brain points. When you level up, you can learn various skills by spending BP on the brain map screen in the menu. Got it. On the on the brain map screen in the menu. Where's the brain map, map screen? Hold up. There we go. All right, bet. So we can enhance, expand. Um, I so use B to recover when knocked down. Increase plug in capacity. Uh, plug in capacity. This increases the attack. Got it. Okay, so I'm gonna use a, a skill right now. Boom. Got it. Attack up one. Skill learned. Dope. I right, cool man. This is dope. I. Right. So, it's that time, y'all. Scarlet Nexus is fire. We're going to come back to this game. But real quick, it's time to talk about that Spider-Man 2. Y'all ready? Let's get it in, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, look. Here's the deal right now, man. Here's what I want to talk to y'all about. Spider-Man 2. PS5 Tech Info. I got some interesting things I want to share with y'all. So we about to get right down to it. Any questions that y'all got, I'll answer a few of them after I'm done talking about it, all right? So here's the first thing I want to share with y'all when it comes to Spider-Man PS5 
tech info. One thing I can tell you from a couple of sources that I got regarding the next Spider-Man game is that you see how Ratchet and Clank looks like how amazing it is. Now, this may not come to as a surprise, but what I can honestly say is that Spider-Man 2 looks better, will look better than Ratchet and Clank. And when I mean look better, I'm talking about like, like how do you get much better than Ratchet and Clank? It looked like a Pixar movie now, like for real. But Spider-Man 2 looks better than Ratchet and Clank. For real. Like, for real. That's one. Two. Spider-Man 2 will be just as populated or more than Ratchet and Clank on PS5. And I talk about, like, the NPCs and just everything that's going on in the world and stuff like that. It's going to be that much more populated than Ratchet and Clank. Like, for real. The third thing I wanted to share is that the ray tracing is a lot better now. A lot better and a lot more fine-tuned. And, whew, whew, the, yo, let's just say the ray tracing is a lot better. I'll just leave it at that. Now, the fourth thing I want to tell you, and this right here was very surprising, but Spider-Man 2 may have, uh, you see how Ratchet and Clank got the ripped apart and you um go into different, like, um, like how you got the Spidey-verse and all this other stuff? Spider-Man 2, let's just say Spider-Man 2 has the ability to go from like different like Spidey verses and stuff like that. So just like how you saw uh, in the movie and you got different places you can go and stuff like that, that is something that can happen in Spider-Man 2. Like that is a possibility. It's, it can be done. It's been explored. I'm not sure if it was finalized though, but it is something that was heavily explored to be able to not just have the game set in you know manhattan and stuff like that but the game to have setting have a setting in other areas outside of the norm and that right there got me like going crazy now another thing i want to share with y'all in terms of uh spider-man 2 and some of the tech info is this now this fight is real crazy so there's technology, right? If you go look up, um, there's a gentleman, I forgot his name, but there's this thing that's called uh, Blushly. And Blushly is something that they use in Unreal Engine 5. Now, I'm not, now I'm not saying Spider-Man is built on Unreal, Unreal Engine. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is there's some technology that's supposed to be coming to Spider-Man 2 where, let's say, something falls on the ground and it breaks down the ground like you can literally continue to break away the actual concrete. So it's not just about buildings falling or breaking or everything. Like the destructible environment is also in the terrain, in the concrete of the game as well, which is very, very interesting because it's supposed to bring the boss battles to life. Another thing about Spider-Man 2 in terms of the tech uh, details and like the tech info is Venom like I'm not sure if they're gonna give you the opportunity to play as Venom or you just fight him as a boss character or something but some of the tech that's being developed for Spider-Man 2 and being added to this engine a lot of the tech points to signs that you will be able to use venom in the next spider-man 2 just based off the tech that's being made so i found that to be very interesting but it's not confirmed that you'll be able to play as venom or anything like that but the things that venom can do and the results of the impact based off the abilities that venom has a lot of these things is being implemented into the game from a tech design standpoint so it's like all signs point to some sort of experience that we would get a chance to have with Venom. So that right there is crazy to me. Now, another thing about Spider-Man, and this right here is crazy. So a lot of what we saw in Spider-Man and a little bit of what we saw in Miles Morales 
is going to be fully explored on PS5. But here's the key thing. I'm not sure if Spider-Man 2 is going to be on PS4 and PS5. From what I'm hearing is I can't confirm this yet. From what I'm hearing, Spider-Man 2 may be a PS5 only title. It may be a PS5 only title and we may see it um, next year, but it might not release until 2023. All right. But, P but, but the PS5 Spider-Man 2 is supposed to be a PS5 only title. This is what I'm hearing. And based, based upon all the other things that I'm hearing in terms of the tech that's in it, it all makes sense in terms of it being a PS5 exclusive title. Now, another thing I want to throw out there, and this wasn't confirmed to me, but it was something that was heavily explored. But the opportunity to have multiplayer in Spider-Man 2. Now, I'm not saying that this is a game where it's like Marvel's Avengers and stuff and it's built to have. No, I'm not talking about like that. I'm talking about having like a mode that's separate from the single player experience that will allow you, that will allow you to have multiplayer in this particular game. And stuff like that and the reason why is because there's a lot of things in spider-man 2 that's going to be heavily influenced by a lot of the comics and that right there is very telling because put it like this right when, when you look at like certain battles that spider-man you know like was in you know it wasn't just him you know what I'm saying he would use the webs and somebody else to come and do this and do that like you know, it's real crazy with what's supposed to be coming and what's supposed to be happening with this Spider-Man 2 game. But based on the technology and the engine and everything that they're doing and things that they learn from their experience with developing Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart, yo, it's going to be crazy. Now, another thing that I will tell you about the next Spider-Man is that weather is supposed to play a major role in the game like literally like dynamic weather is supposed to play a major role in the game and also you're gonna see a lot more of peter parker too so these has these things that i'm saying has been explored you know in spider-man or spider-man 2 next level new a whole new trajectory of what it could be done so the final thing i want to say about this is the references that was used to explain the detail of Spider-Man 2 and what's coming. Do y'all remember the Unreal Engine 5 demo that we saw uh, when they uh, unveiled it on PlayStation 5? How the how the girl was like flying through the world and everything, and it looked like a it looked like a cinematic movie. Like it was crazy and stuff like that. How open it was and everything, and like how dense like the city like like that city was and everything like that. That is the type of detail to expect with spider-man 2 like go back and look at that unreal engine 5 trailer you know that they showed and that's the level of quality you can expect come 2023 when spider-man 2 is supposed to actually uh come out so yeah get excited man because what's happening now going forward with these different games we're gonna see things that we thought wasn't even possible and the last thing I will say, which is very interesting, is a lot of a lot of the technology that not just, you know, Sony, but Microsoft and um, a lot of uh, game engines and just developers around the world, the cloud is being utilized in a major way from a development standpoint within these video games. So anybody that was sleeping on a cloud technology before, you need to wake up now. You really need to wake up now because the cloud is going to allow for a lot of data, a lot of um, streaming, a lot of better game design, period. I'll give you an example of what I mean. When you look at Microsoft Flight Simulator, a lot of that data and detail is literally from the cloud, like instantly streaming in from the cloud, yo, like natively. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable what can happen now. So, yeah, man, that's some of the tech in terms of Spider-Man 2. And another thing that was very interesting, and I didn't get a confirmation on this, but I did ask about it. But you see how um, you got so many buildings uh, in a lot of these open-world games? Like, 
you may be able to walk inside every single building be able to go up to each like everything that you see should be accessible to you which means that everything that you see is not designed to be cosmetic only if you see it you can go inside it like be a part of it like everything is really a part of the world so that's it like i just want to share um some details that i received regarding spider-man um ps5 and the tech uh being designed for this particular game and you know just a couple of features that um is you know being discussed and stuff like that but i'm very excited and if they do bring that multiplayer um it will be something separate from the single single player um obviously and i think it's something that could be very healthy for the universe of spider-man and where it could go and how unique it can be when you you know have somebody that you could play with in that world so get ready man like it's gonna be very interesting so there's a bunch of other things that i'm working on too a bunch of other interviews that i'm gonna have shortly to uh share with y'all but as of right now this next generation of gaming is gonna be unlike anything we ever seen or experienced from a development tech standpoint get ready get hyped you already know what it is. Y'all got questions? Talk to me right now. Let me know what's up. All right, so Walter Hurst, uh, the graphics for Spider-Man 2 is going to be like, oh my God, it looks like you're in New York City and I know a game you're talking about with the Unreal Engine 5. Got it. Yeah, this is going to be the most detailed, like, when we talk about, like, city games, this will be the most detailed city game ever made, in my opinion, based off what I'm hearing. And based off what's possible so definitely this will be the most detailed one unless you know ubisoft pull out some tricks with the next the division and you go back to new york but even with that i don't see nobody touching the sound of that game especially considering this is an exclusive title uh with spider-man 2. um david uh imagine if spider-man 2 looked like cinematic cinematic trailer tv spot listen you it's nothing you have to imagine like this is it like we're here like the fourth wall has been broken like movie quality graphics is real like we you're gonna see it yeah insomniac at this point right now they are the goat currently right now we'll see how long that lasts but right now insomniac is the best period right now well until gta 6 show what they show their hands Right now, Insomniac got that title. I can't wait for Sony's next event. So other than that, I'm excited. I just wanted to share that with y'all. We're about to go back and play a little bit more of Scarlet Nexus. Then after that, we're going to wrap up the show. So I hope y'all enjoying yourselves. Are y'all having a good time on the show? Y'all enjoying yourselves? Please like, subscribe, share, and let everybody know we're getting it popping right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, What do y'all think about the Scarlet Nexus game so far? And other than that, let's have some fun. So we about to get back to the game. That was Spider-Man um, PS5. Uh, interesting tech info. Uh, and um, like I said, man, simply based off the tech info, something with Venom is definitely going on. As soon as I get some more info on it, I'll let you know. But there's a lot of interesting things that represent what Venom is all about simply based off the tech and what's possible now. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Let's get it. Yeah, we back, baby. Thankful for since uh hold up. That you want Goblin to return? No doubt. I don't think Goblin's gonna be on this next one though. You know what I'm saying? And um, you know, uh uh Fisk and all of them, I don't think they're gonna be um in this one. But like I said, man, um the environment, the level design, all of that, uh Spider-Man 2 is looking to be a completely oh, different it beast. Looks like another group of cadets has arrived. That must be Cadet Yuito Sumeragi and Cadet Nagi Carmen. So, it appears you were able to fight an other before your official assignment. How was your first fight? Huh? 
Were you afraid? Uh, no. I just used my training. I see. So you were able to fight calmly. Although still a cadet, you are a true Scarlet Guardian. Amazing. Really? Cadet Yuito Sumeragi, what will you tell your father, Chairman Sumeragi, about your actions today? I've been ordered not to answer any questions. Excuse me. Nagi, let's go! You got a big head for a cadet. Huh? What did you say? All right, everyone, don't fight. I'm Kyoka Eden of the 1st Regiment, 8th Company. I, Kyoka Eden. Your cadet Yuito Sumeragi. Curtis, what's up, baby? Carmen, right? Chief Kaito Sumeragi has asked to see both of you. Hurry to the chief's office. Yo, what up, Eddie? Be ready Salute. for lecture. You did a good thing. And yeah, like I said, that's what I was told. As a and um OSF. Good luck. And uh I'm not sure when they're gonna announce anything though. What up, James? I see you. What's going on, baby? What love? Yo, Ant, what's up? You said anything game changing coming out this year? So uh I'm not sure if this is coming out this year. But but one game you need to look out for is this game called Lost Soul Aside. Sony is supposed to show this off in a major way. And if it's what I'm expecting, is that's going to be a game-changing type of title. Lost Soul Aside. Yo, I like this joint right here. Oh, man, you missed it, James. You're going to have to go back and look at it, bro. Yo, Jedi, you know what's up. You know what's up with that Lost Soul aside, baby. Scarlet Nexus. Yo, this joint. Hold on. Yo, this joint was literally like a like a whole oh achievement. Like a whole like movie just coming on right now, son. Like an animated movie. Yo, um, I'm playing on PC right now, but you can get it on um PS5 and uh Xbox. Seto. First have everyone introduce themselves. Tell us what your powers are. It's best to be familiar with the type of powers in your platoon. For example, my power is electrokinesis. All right, you first, Hanabi. Understood. I'm Hanabi Ichijo. My power is pyrokinesis. Happy to be here. Nagi Carmen, my power is air manipulation. It was my dream to be in the OSF. I'm wow. honored to serve under Septentrion 7th class Captain Narukami. I'm Yuito Sumeragi. My a word, no doubt, Curtis. I was saved by an OSF trooper as a child. I'll do my best to repay that debt. Oh, so you're the famous Yuito. You were all over the news last night. Yeah, I can see Sony picking up arc systems. I can see that. That'd be crazy. Enough messing around, Kagero. Introduce yourself. <laughs> Yes, Captain. Okay, all you babies of the 567th class. I'm Kagero Dawn, the late blooming genius. Kagero Dawn. Only you call yourself that. You're so harsh, Captain. So, Yuito and Nagi, you're volunteer soldiers? I'm an adult, so we're in the same boat. Nice to meet everyone. 
I'm sure we'll get along. What does he mean by adult? Adults are OSF troops who weren't scouted until later in life. You didn't know? They're like us that volunteered for the OSF instead of being scouted. Basically fodder. That's right. I'm just trash here, but I do my best. Let's work together to stay alive. Don't worry about how you got here. Only the strong and highly thought of survive in this world. Worrying about what others think is pointless. Okay? Next is Wataru. I'm Wataru Frazier. My power is reading thoughts. Basically telepathy. Sukumi Nazar. My power is clairvoyance. Nice to meet you. So, it's a platoon full of weirdos. We should fit right in with the rest of the OSF. Everyone do your best. Moving on. We'll start with guard duty as your hand. Yo, Ron is in the building. Salute, bro. What's going on, dog? With me. How's the family, man? With Sugumi and Hanabi with Yuito. Connect your SAS with each other. Get ready and reconvene at the entrance to Kikuchiba in one hour. That is all. Dismissed. Long time no see, Yuito. Hanabi! Oh, what's it been? Two years? Who would have thought we'd get put in the same platoon? You know Miss Ichijo? Call me Hanabi. Yuito and I are childhood friends. Wow, but we didn't see you at all as cadets. Oh, I was scouted. I see. The training areas for scouted and... See, that's what I like to hear, Ron. 100, all day. I appreciate I that, son. Hanabi. Much love to you. Hey, do you know Naomi Randall? The Randall sisters? I know them. Those two are the real elites. Kasane was scouted by the OSF when she was 12. She was scouted that young? Huh? <laughs> you know Kasane? Yeah. Wow. We fought others together yesterday. What? You mean that other attack? No way. Kasane didn't say anything about it. Are you friends with the Randall sisters? Not really. I talk to Naomi a lot, but Kasane is... I'm pretty sure the only one friendly with Kasane is Naomi. Oh, really? Can you introduce me to Naomi? Oh, so that's how it is. Naomi is cute. Hey, you three. Quit your jabbering and get to Kikuchiba. Yes, yes sir. sir! See you later. I can't believe my first assignment is with you. I'm excited. Yo, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, man. I I'm really loving the voice yeah, acting in this that? game too. Like, voice yes. acting is very important. That's an important skill to have. You know what I'm saying? Because it's kind of like uh, you can just call me it just Wattaroo. makes it more real There's in terms of the story. For you about bias. Looks like they messed up. Bias? It's an OSF developed brain assistance system that amplifies and helps maximize your power. Every year they choose subjects to gather combat data on the system, and this year you're one of them. I won't sugarcoat it. It's still in development, so it's unstable, and the side effects aren't clear. Uh, so they want me to be a guinea pig. Sorry if I scared you. They've done tests before so that people who aren't compatible aren't selected. So don't worry too much. Either way, it's an order, so you can't refuse. Just try starting it up. It should have installed with all the other systems. Is this right? Nothing seems different except for visuals. Let's go. The system and I love how they introduce brain. new Using powers power and tech in the game, making you understand why it's there. There's a backstory to everything in this game, yo. On. I love it. This will make connecting to SAS smoother too. It'll still hurt a lot though. I think I got the gist of it. Thank you for explaining all of this to me. Even though I told you not to worry, there are some nasty rumors about bias causing people to lose their minds or become emotionally unstable. So if you feel strange at all, don't strain yourself. Mm. Okay, thanks. I'll be careful. This is well, dope. That's it for me. Oh, and you don't have to be all polite with me. Just take it easy. All right, don't be late for your mission. I'm a little worried about being an experiment. Well, I guess it won't change anything. Okay, I'll head to Kikuchiba when I'm ready. All 
All right, so Kikuchiba has been added to the world map. We travel to another location. Yo. All right. Now I can travel to another location. Kikuchibi, no Kikuchiba. All right, we're going to Kikuchichi, son. Kikuchichi. We about to go there right now, so it's gonna be fire. Loving this game so far, yo. Real talk. All right, let's go. Game is smooth, too. It plays great, looks great, feels great, all of that. So, we're all here. Captain Narukami, may I ask a question? You don't have to be so formal. We call each other by our first names in the OSF so we can strengthen our bonds. Most of us don't look our age. Ranks are there just to calculate pay. Yo, you know I ain't start playing that yet, bro. The Genshin Impact. I ain't start playing it. That. That's the gist of it. So what was your question? Right. Um, Wataru isn't here yet. Wataru is this platoon's operator. He'll direct us from headquarters. My power allows me to communicate telepathically without the system's assistance, up to around 500 kilometers. With that being said, it's a lot of work. So join the group. Open your personal port. Team leaders will be Nagi, Yuito, and Sugumi. Each of you, listen to Wataru's orders and move to the designated goal. Try to take down any others along the way. Retreat is allowed if you think you can't handle it, but reach your goal. That's all. Understood. Okay. See you later. Good luck. All right, let's go. The teams are split up, but you can use brain talk to share information. Oh, let's go. Oh, as is a brain, the brain connection with, with virtual cable. Oh wow, you could this allows you to temporarily use allies powers. Wow. Okay, go pressing. Got it. Each power lasts for a limited time. You can stop the effect yourself. Okay. Alright. Oh wow, that's fire! So we was able to connect, and I'm using her power with me. Yo, this is fire, son! Wow, that was sick. That was sick. That was sick, sick. Like yo, son, that was fire, bro. Oh man. That was dope, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Yo, this is fire. OG, what's up? You said, what's the last game that I beat? Um, Rats in the Clank. That's that's the last game that I beat, bro. Um, right now I'm playing um a lot of uh the Outer Worlds, so I'm about to uh you know get done with that. Hold up. With a... Yo, let's go. Enough uh fire damage will inflict burn status. Additional damage is taken. Oh wow. Okay. Wow. Wow. This game is sick. Don't wander off. Don't go into heavily damaged areas. Here we go. Understood. I'm good at reading the air. I mean, my power is aerokinesis after all. Hmm. Uh, that awkward pause was my power too. Wow. This joint is fire, son. The menu isn't that bad to um understand either. Let me go upstairs and see. Oh, 
I have to water the flowers at headquarters. Oh, I already did that. The seeds we planted in those pots have sprouted. Nice oh, hold up. Come on, I know, right? Every household should have a dependable Kagero. Let's go. Oh, shoot. Hold up. It being real disrespectful right now. Hold up. This is pretty rare. Let's go. Oh, you said, do I remember Hugo? Uh, Hugo. Hugo. Uh, refresh my memory, bro. Wait, that, my bad. All right, let me save this game. I bet, and this is where I go shop at. So let's see, let's see what they got though to, to buy. All right, cool. So pretty much light jelly recovers thirty percent. Um, oh okay. Uh, let me grab this up. Seems like a bet. Change equipment. Bad. Change equipment. So um. So what I got, I'm trying to see uh, what's, what should I get. So power attack. Attack 64. Wait. Hold up. Wait a minute. This is the visual of the costume. So I'm trying to. Health boost. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, he's, I got the plug-in. So that's how I... Oh, okay. All right, I'm learning. I'm learning more. I'm learning. All right, let me go back and see what else we got here. Force field. Okay, I'm going to get one of these. Vet. Change equipment. Um. Right, I'm going to give her the force field, though. I bet we lit. All right, let me come back out. Oh, we got power enhancement. Okay. I'm going to get a power enhancement too. Uh, yeah, I'm going to just keep it like this for now. All right. Yo, this is dope. I like that system. All right, let's get it. Oh, um, oh, hold down to consume the PK guards and attack with special objects. Oh, word. Okay. Oh, 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 that's hot. That's hot. Oh, shoot. Oh! So, oh, if you dodge an enemy attack at just the right time, you perform a perfect dodge. That grants you temporary invulnerability, give you the advantage in battle. That is fire. Let's go! This game is sick. Look at this. Oh, yo, this game is fire, son. This game is fire. I don't know what to do no more.
I don't. I don't know what to do no more, son. Yo, this game is sick. Oh man, and you can disengage with oh uh, you can disengage like this. Okay, got it. So you can don't okay. This is crazy, son. This game is fire. Oh, Detective Hugo? Oh man. I don't think I played that game. Of course I'm getting Ghost of Tsushima. Uh uh director's cut T. Shout out to T Marsu in the building. The Ghost of Sushishi. You know that. It feels like I'm in a VR from a theme park I went to when I was a kid. It used to serve as a connection base, so get to. The city infrastructure was destroyed in another attack about five years ago. So what you see is what remains. Togetsu is the stronghold of the Togetsu faith, right? It's kind of like a cult. Don't say that out loud. Kagero is a believer. He was even a priest at one time. What? That guy is a priest? Hey, did you realize I can hear you, right? Don't forget, our Platoon's headsets are all connected. Sorry. No, don't worry about it. My parents were believers, so I just naturally became a priest. I don't care about the teachings at all. Now that Kikuchiba is like this, you hardly ever see people coming to Suo from the church anymore. What's that drone doing? Yo, gaming despairs in the building. Salute, what up, gaming? You say you don't know how you got here, so I'm not sure if you know me, but I'm the one and only hip hop gamer, bro. Hot 97 Logitech G. Salute, thanks for being here. Let's get it. So, so far, I'm loving this game, yo. Loving this game. They're pretty, but kind of scary. Yeah, it's like they're looming up there. Let's go. Hold up. Let's go. Let's go. Loving this game, man. Are right, we going to the upper level? Let's go. Let's go. Oh, this is fire, son. Yo, why is it this fire, son? Look at this. Look at this joint. Oh, my God. Let's go. Yo, this game, the combat, what you can do, the way it look, it's like you playing an anime cartoon, like games, bro. Games is fire, son. What I'm talking about. Wow, look at this. Look at that. Yo, like whoever thought of that in the de in the design boardroom is genius, yo. Look at this. Like when you dodge at the right time, you know what I'm saying? Wow. This is crazy. T Marshall, um, yeah, yeah. I, uh yeah, I'm a fan of um Pops uh Pop Smoke, rest in peace. I, um, I like Pop Smoke. I, I love Pop Smoke. He was doing his thing. Um, uh, rappers I'm a fan of. I mean, tons, man. You know, Kendrick, J. Cole, Eminem. Um, uh, I love a lot of the battle rappers, um, as well. You know, I'm a rapper's rapper. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, um, who, who else I like? Um, 50 Cent is always... Um, you know, some of the new rappers, um, that's out right now, they got some songs that I like, you know, like, like the baby and Lou baby, they got some songs that I like, but I don't really listen to them for like hot lyrics and stuff like that. You know what I mean? It's not like that, you know?
You know, my man Ricky Betts. Uh, who's incredible. My boy Warren Went. Uh, who's really, really dope. Um, yeah, man. There's a lot of rappers, man. that um of course leon dilated peoples yeah classic man that's hip-hop right there son uh griselda yo so i like uh benny the butcher is cool um conway is fire um uh, what's the name um uh uh west side gun um i'm not really feeling white west side gun that much as like a you know a lyricist like rap and stuff like that. I like his style in terms of, um, you know, like like the way he uh, do his own thing within the Griselda group. I like the fact that he has his own style, but even with his own style, it could be annoying at times. All that do 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 like all that stuff is annoying. But he, even with how annoying it is. It works sometimes, for the most time, but for the most part, that joint is annoying. RJ Payne, I love him. The Locksmith is dope. You know, Papoose is one of the greats. There's yeah, so many people, man. All right, let's go save the game. Um, oh yeah, DMX all day, man. Come on, rest in peace, man. You know what I'm saying? That's the dog right there. You already know what it is. Tech Nine, of course, man. Word up, Big Gucci. What's up? You said Don Don Montana. Who's that? I don't think I've ever heard of him. You know what I'm saying? Put me on. He nice or what? What's up? Um, yeah, I got that already. Like what's the name? This that new dude, uh, Wooty. Um, I'm not a. Uh, I, I like that song. Um, he has out. Um, it's uh, it's it's pretty cool what he got out right now. I love the energy, you know, on that record. And stuff. So that's dope. Let's see where that goes. You know, we got a we got a crazy lineup for um you know what's the name of uh, summer jam uh, this year we got some we got something real special that that's not even on that that billboard it's like a, a super secret that's gonna be crazy when, when people see it I, okay I think I gotta go back downstairs Also, who you said is just another 69? Yo, big Gucci. Um, well, me personally, Gucci, I don't care about streams and views and stuff like that on an artist. Like, you can have all the streams in the world. A lot of that stuff is fabricated and and brought and hustled. Like, that's just good marketing. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't really care about that stuff. I care about if you actually got skills, if you, you know, dedicated. You know what I'm saying? You, you know, you all about the process being successful like you know what i'm saying like a lot of these rappers that you hear today they ain't gonna be around like how long eminem has been around like how long jay-z has been around and stuff like that i'm looking for like real like artists like you know what i mean not not people that's like i mean not to say i'm looking for real artists like i ain't no a and no, I, ain't put, I ain't signing nobody i'm just saying like you know that's what i look for you know personally i'm looking to see if this art is gonna is gonna be around for the next twenty years, you know, making stuff, you know. I I think I'm lost, y'all. I think I'm lost. And I don't like yeah, I know how I get. I don't like being lost in video games. So hopefully there's something What am I not seeing? Like what am I not paying attention to? I can't go through here. Oh, oh, I'm bugging. Okay, here we go. I 
I found it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yo, you know it's real when you get those big openings. You know what I'm saying? You know it's about to be a boss battle or something. Oh, Yuito's team is the first to the objective. Nice going. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I know about Chef G and Sleepy Hollow. I know about them. Do you hear something? Good instinct, um, Yuito. Well, it's not going to be a state of play, uh, Marcel. It's going to be a whole showcase. Wait. Major others are others that have killed OSF members in the past. Captain. It'll take a few minutes for the rest of the teams to arrive. This may be rough for rookies, but hold out. Yuito, Hanabi, look alive! Oh, wow, let's go. I guess we've got no choice. Hanabi, let's go! All right, I'm ready. Oh, let's go. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, shoot. Hold up. They being disrespectful. Hold on a second. Hold up. Oh, come on, man. Like, I moved out the way. Come on, man. Woo! Hey, man, come on. Oh, come on. Let's regroup now. Dag, yo. This is nothing. Let's go. Dag. One thing I would say about this game, I wish the um I wish the uh Oh, let's go! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about, baby. Let's go. Oh! Here we go. Hey. Oh, shoot. Hold up. Yo, he punched me in my face. For real. Let's go. Yo, this is a battle right here. Hold on a second. Not yet. Come on. Hey, come on. Let's regroup now. Dang. Come on, y'all. Yo, the dodge needs to be uh it's not as responsive as I wish it was. Like when you're dodging and trying to get out the way, it's not as responsive because it's kinda like when you're like when you're in when you're in mid attack, like a lot of games you could break out of the dodge even in mid attack. And this one it's not as forgiving, so. This is no. I can still fight. Don't get burned. Let's go. 
Oh, let's go. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh, man. Oh, dang. Yeah, he's still burning, son. Got him. Got him, baby. That's what I'm talking about, son. Did we do it? Are the boss battles is fire here. Oh shoot. Oh, stay back or you'll get hurt. Oh wow. to defeat the other your first victory on your first deployment was it satisfying um uh, crazy i can't answer you very oh well 75 myself. inch i play on Please, i play on a 75 inch tv i like the big tvs yo and my tv got incredible motion so i play with motion flow on i like the i like the soap opera effect that joint looked mad real Hi, Marcel. God That's bless and salute, dog. Superiors about. We're pulling out. The mission doesn't end until we get to Suo. Keep your eyes open. Understood. No sign of the crows. Looks like they got their sights on Yuito this year. Excuse me? What do you mean, this year? Every year, the crows latch on to whoever stands out among the rookies. He or she becomes their new star. It's gonna be rough here on out. What? Oh, man. That just means you'll be in the limelight. You may get tons of interview requests. Maybe they'll put him on the PR magazine like Arashi. Could be. They don't know when to quit. Yuito, I know it'll be a pain, but don't answer directly. Just evade any questions. Yeah, I'll do my best. Here they come. Oh, looks like Sagumi found the crows. Okay, we'll keep this short. That's the end of this assignment. From now on, our orders will be sent directly from above. You can't refuse a deployment order. Go to the designated place at the designated time and carry out your mission. You can take on suppression assignments and training at your leisure, but don't slack off too much. Crows. They'll be here soon. We're jamming them, but it's just a matter of time. If you have any further questions, ask Wataru. Okay, back to Suo. Captain, can I be excused here? I want to make a stop. You have to do it right now. Wouldn't you like to know? Yeah, yeah, fine. Do whatever you want. Love you, Captain. Alright. So, y'all. This game is fire so far. Um, Here's what I want to tell y'all. First of all, the show has been great. Y'all have been great. Thank you for hanging out with me. Um, My takeaways with Scarlet Nexus is this. Graphically, the joint like you're playing an anime cartoon. It looks incredible. So I love the way the game looks. Gameplay-wise, 
um the gameplay is really good but it's not perfect i think that there's a slight stiffness to this game which prevents it from being perfectly responsive and what i mean by that is for example when i'm playing and i need to dodge and get out the way um even when i push the button it feels like it's a little late than what it should be and I get caught in areas where I feel I shouldn't get caught at. You know what I'm saying? And when you compare it to different games like a Devil May Cry or God of War or any of those games that, that have some sort of evasiveness to it, you know what I'm talking about where when you hit the button, it's like it's instant. In this game, it feels a little stiff so it doesn't flow as nicely. And even in the middle of attacking and stuff like that, it's like you just can't break out in time. You know what I mean? So it feels a little um, a slight, like a smidge delayed and less responsive so that right there um it's annoying it's annoying uh another thing i would say about this game is like in terms of the combat itself though the combat itself overall is fire and i'm loving the way the game is allowing you to grow and like the trajectory of the game all the things you could do like when you hold a left trigger and you're utilizing the environment to do different things to have bigger impact on your attacks and then the telekinesis there and just the traditional attacks and stuff this game is dope and then how you could use the sas and put the brain connection together and do better stuff and get fire to your weapon like all of that is fire all of it is fire um i like the fact that this game is easy to progress like you know where to go next because of the way the waypoints are um on the map so that right there is fun um the story is dope and i love how they introduce each character it makes it easy to understand and what's going on and there's a backstory to all the elements that makes up the game so you feel connected to it that right there is important so i love that um there's a lot to love about this game man um scarlet nexus yo i definitely recommend it um go pick it up yo go check it out uh this is the pc version that um, i'm playing on but yeah man like go cop this game i think you're gonna like it all right on that note it's the one and only hip-hop gamer logitech g on your hot 97 every day that's my word salute to everybody that showed up thank you very much take care enjoy the rest of your night peace